So what's with the blocking of the MRT platform door and causing a delay? Before I get into this video, I'm GH, Singapore number one renting fan. So it's been so long since I ever do a rent video. But I came across this video recently. It really pisses me off. So another drama happens after I don't know how many donkey years. But this is not the first drama we citizens ever experienced. There are many other dramas like train vandalizing, scenic in the public transport and nobody's business, or shouting on somebody's name in the bus. It's my son! But recently, this 12 years old kid really went to the next level. He went to block the MRT platform door and cause a train delay. He's lucky that it's at 5 pm when he does this shit. Can you imagine what will happen if he does it at 6 am when everybody rushing for work? He will get smacked in his face big time, not gonna lie. Other than that, let's watch this video. Let's watch this. I'm gonna force the PSDs and. Okay, perfect. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go far away so that I want too much of a suspect. You are already a suspect, my dear boy, by just uploading this stupid video. Plus, there are CCTV cameras everywhere in the platforms and stations. You can lie about what you did, but cameras footage don't lie. Uh oh! Haha, <laughs> failure! This kid still thinks he's funny, he does not even know because of what he has done. Actually caused a lot of inconvenience such as train delay, affecting about 100 passengers on board the train and the first time I had to run and manually start the train. Oh, this is cool. This is so cool. That's cool. You literally caused the train to stop moving and delay everybody's time. You think it is cool? What by throwing your Vanguard card fight that into the trash and say it's cool? Oh, it actually went off. <laughs> yes, you should be lucky it actually went off because the train could be broke down because of you. You just don't know how serious it is. You could be fined one thousand for it. Wait, not sure if you he, if he was actually fined one thousand dollars for it. I'm very off topic right now, but eventually he got a police report. Well, I guess he deserved it big time. According to the news, this kid trying to do a TikTok life hacks. I just want to say that TikTok is TikTok, real life is real life. Mistakes you make in real life cannot be corrected sometimes. And some TikTok life hacks is fake. If you are a considerate person, the most you can do is give the staff a break by not doing all this kind of stupid shit. The staff had a long day from work and they needed to rest. But still, thanks to the SMRT staff, he managed to save the train and let it continue to run smoothly. Because issues like this can actually be a declared a breakdown. Anyways, thanks for watching my video. I see you guys in my next video. Bye.